Word of God. You don't want to just preach the Word of God. You want to teach it and preach it with authority. Authority. Function. Who has authority? The person that knows yes. where they stand with God. That's it. Amen. The person that knows who they are in Christ. Yes. They have authority. Yep. I tell some of the young women in our church, I say, hey, God's going to use you to cast some demons out. Me, Pastor, me? You. But I'm just a nobody. You Then you won't be able to help me if you think you're a nobody. Get that. <laughs> you need to know who you are. Yeah. Why do you think I take time to teach people? Because we need to teach them, brother. Amen. We need to teach the folks. You are a mighty warrior of God. That's it. You are not just some Joe Blow in some corner. You are a mighty man of God, a mighty woman of God. And God has revealed this in his word. Amen? Amen. Now, let's identify a couple of examples of who has an authority. Do you want to know whether you have authority oh, have in Jesus one. or not? How many of you want to know whether you have authority? You have authority. Take this verse with you in your spirit. Right there in the book of Mark, just go over to chapter 3. Mm -hmm. Mark chapter 3. So we can see who has authority. Thank you, sister. There it is. So we can see who has the authority. Oh, we can. Anybody being blessed this morning? Amen. Amen. Okay. I want to make sure of this. Sometimes when folks are quiet, it just kind of makes me go, Whoa, what's going on? Listen. Mark chapter 3, verse 13 to 15. Listen to what it says. There it is. Listen to what it says. I was trying to read the Spanish version. I'm sorry. Go ahead. And he went up on the mountain and, sur and surrounded, or summoned, summoned, sorry, summoned those who he himself wanted, and they came to him. Yeah. And he appointed 12 so that they would be with him. Mm -hmm. So that they would be with who? Him. Yeah. With him. Amen. Remember what I said about the priesthood? Yeah. What is priesthood? Mm -hmm. What is a priest? Yeah. Someone who has the ability to get close to God. Yeah. Why did God wants to make you a priest? Why does he want to make you a priest? Yeah. So that you can be close to him. Amen. Listen to this. He says right there. Verse 13. And he went up onto the mountain and summoned those whom he himself wanted. There it is. I want you to know that God chose you because you're wanted from him. All right. You are wanted. There was a poster in heaven. 